be educated horses now. That's right. Welcome to the Rustling Leaves Library, the new town building and Ponytown update uh, number version 0 0.100.0. We've not made it to a, a 1.0 release. That's right. They skipped 1.0 and went straight to 0 0.100. Who would have seen it coming? Um, maybe a lot of people. Um, I kind of saw this coming. But anyway, let's talk about this update because it's actually really exciting. We got a new building, as I mentioned before. It adds a library building with a library reading room, a lecture room, a science area, hallway with lockers and notice board, uh, library reception area, outdoor reading areas, and functional clocks. The functional clocks are one of the things I'm most excited about, to be honest with you, because I've wanted functional clocks in the game for a super long time, and we finally have them. Along with that, they've also added two lecture room music tracks. Uh, they added library reading mu room music track. They added the ability to place books and paper sheets in the library, bakery, and certain outdoor spots. They added the ability to take books from bookshelves, added new holdable items, including 25 different books, a notebook, paper sheets, pencil, quill, chalk, sponge, um, and a pointing stick. They also added two new I item uh, edible items. Well, Technically, it's six. They added a banana peel, which you can now hold and eat, and five types of herbs, which you can now hold and eat. They added a picnic blanket spot to the forest below the library. They added a slash dice as an alias for slash roll. So now if you want to type in something like uh, roll out of six, you can now do slash dice six and it will roll out of six for you. Uh, they also added uh, slash SMH as an alias for slash head shake uh, as a command. So now instead of shaking your head by typing in slash head shake, you can literally just type in slash SMH and it will do it for you. They completed the construction, which is obviously the library or whatever. They improved the they improved improved the forest below the library, they improved interactions with some objects, improved place point interact uh, priority, improved colliders of some objects, so some colliders you might notice like some objects when you're rubbing against them, running against them, whatever like that might feel slightly different. They improved camera behavior inside bakery, I didn't really know notice anything before and after this, so I'm not really sure exactly what that did. But they improved the nom action icon, they improved UI for refreshing names of linked socials, and of course, they improved localization and fixed a handful of things such as exterior bakery lights not turning on or off properly. So, uh, other other than that, map errors, etc. So, obviously, there's not really much to say about this update other than to just hop into the game and kind of show the um, the library a little bit. So, boom, here we go. I'm just gonna boom. Here I am. I'm 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 not at the library, but I can walk over there. I cannot move. There we go. Wow, this laptop sucks ass. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so obviously the library, if you follow this path this way, there's also some signs and stuff like that, which will allow you to find the library. It's quite easy to find. I also find it a little bit interesting that they call it a library because, like, it technically not a library if you really think about it um but we have like a little seating area out here and some plants out here so if you want to learn about herbology or something that person just sneezed and instantly died that's pretty cool um but yeah here's the library i think it looks pretty nice at night uh, here's a zoomed out shot of it. It's got some uh, like branches and stuff like that growing out of it. I think it looks uh, quite lovely in my honest opinion. Um, but yeah, this clock uh, functions. As you can see, it is slowly turning and it should be turning in with the end game time. Yes, it should be changing with the end game time. Um, but yes, you're most curious of what it looks like on the inside. This is what it looks like on the inside. It's going to be chaotic. Um, and so because of how chaotic it's going to be, I'm probably not going to be playing in the library, uh, quote unquote library, uh, for a couple of days, maybe a week or something before I really go in here and like properly fully explore and everything like that. I mean, I've already seen it empty, but that's besides the point. Um, I, I just recommend that you don't get too excited about like seeing every nook and cranny about this because you're probably not going to actually be able to see every nook and cranny of this building. Uh, but yeah, uh, here, see, this is why I find it a little bit odd that they call it like a library, because it's very obviously a school. Also, uh, people are glitching out over here. Um, I, I almost, how the fuck did they do that, actually? I wonder how they did that. As as expected, um, I 100% saw something like this coming, but that's besides the point. Uh, I find it weird that they call it a library when it's very obviously a school. I mean, you got like literally a classroom right here with like, uh, another like learning thing over here they had they had cauldrons i can't wait to get that on the the party island and stuff like that i can't wait to get a lot of this stuff on the party island like books and everything else uh and then like it also has um lockers and stuff like that libraries don't have lockers so that's just a weird thing to me like why does it have lockers um and a reception area that obviously makes sense to have um 
but yeah, and then here's the actual library half of like the building and everything like that. It's obviously the majority of stuff. Here's a cool thing that you can do though is you can come up come up to the the bookshelf and click on it and you can get a book for and get a book from it. You can get a book from it if you if you click on it and that's a pretty cool a uh, little detail and there's some cozy corners and stuff like that overall again there's really not much to say about this other than the fact that like look there's 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 a there's a library now i mean it's technically not a library but here's the banana peel by the way it's in the garbage so have fun with that and uh yeah i mean that's that's pretty much it like there's there's really not really anything special to say about this it's it's just it's just a building, I guess. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, news update video or whatever like that, however short it may have been. Um, but if you did enjoy it, however you enjoyed it, I would sure as heck appreciated it. If you liked, subscribed, shared, and did any number of those wonderful things like that. Because when you do wonderful things like that, not only do you get access to wonderful content such as this, but you also get to become wonderful yourself. And I think we all want that. Do those wonderful things, and until next time, stay wonderful.